Hey guys, what's up? We're back here with another episode of the Godric Manston My Player Season number 34 here. And we've just come out of two international games for England where we played in the Euro qualifiers and did pretty well in them. Didn't get the results we wanted, got two draws instead of some wins. But here in this episode coming up, we've got West Brom at home in the Premier League at Stamford Bridge. And then we have our next fixture in this episode, which is against Seville in the Champions League, which means it's going to be our Champions League debut if we get picked to play. This is going to be a big game for us if we can get into that. But for now, we're going to sit here and wait and see what happens in this Premier League game against West Brom before that. We're just arriving here at Stamford Bridge early in the afternoon before the game is about to kick off. And we're just going to walk in here, making our way to the stadium. Nice summer months, nice and hot in the shorts. And here we go, I'm coming into the game now at Stamford Bridge. We've been settling in well at Chelsea here. And we're just going to get into this game now against West Brom. It's going to be a pretty good game. We're not actually doing too well in the league so far, as you can see. Sitting down in 13th place with a win, a draw and a loss in the Premier League table. One of the lowest scoring teams in the league at the moment. We're just not having a good start. Too busy focusing on other things like the Champions League and other stuff like that. But we need to focus on the league and get some decent points away here in this game at home against West Brom. Let's see what we can do here. Pedro on the pitch. We've got Solanke. They're playing a weak inside Chelsea though. So this is going to be a bit tougher for us because they are saving their players for the home fixture against Seville in the Champions League in the next game. But here we are kicking off anyway. Manston playing on the right wing, starting the game as well. Corner kick here, coming into the box here. Nothing coming of that one there. But it comes out, gets touched down by the strike from Manston here. Can he take a shot here on the edge of the box? Cutting inside, getting a shot away there. But it gets blocked by the defender and nothing coming of it. Seventh minute here and here we come on an attack now. And we work around Pedro passing it central to Mikel. Mikel, can we get it in the box now? Yes, we can. To the feet of the striker. Can he hold on to the ball long enough to lay it off nicely? Yes, he can. There it goes into the box of Van Ginkel. Van Ginkel has gone and scored. He's made it 1-0 here against West Brom. Van Ginkel with the goal. That's why with the got assists. And that makes it 1-0 here against West Brom. Nice and early on in the eighth minute, I believe, of this game. And Van Kinkle goes and scores there. That's his first goal of the season, I believe. And that is a good start for Chelsea in the Premier League for this game. Looking for a win after all for the, all three points. And we can push on now and get that win that we've been looking for. Not a bad goal at all. Not a single thing done by Manston there. Just worked around nicely by the Chelsea players. Worked into the box. A three ball from the striker who held it up nicely and it goes in for a goal for Van Ginkel from the midfield. And here we come now on the next couple of attacks. Nothing coming of that through ball there that was meant for the player, but it didn't come to it there. Here comes Chadley on the ball now for West Brom, passing it central to Jakob. Jakob passing it back to Rondon, who has a shot there, but it goes straight into the hands of Katoi and he kicks it out of play. Here come Chelsea on the attack from the midfield at the halfway line now, pushing forward. Can we get the ball to Manston? Here it comes to Manston's feet, pushing up the left wing now, swapping sides, cutting into the box here. Great chance for Manston to go on and score! And he's just gone and had a good save from the keeper. Unlucky there for Manston. And we've continued on approaching half time now. Manston getting on the ball once again. Not a bad half at all this has been for Chelsea. Another chance here. Can we work it into the box to make it 2 0 just before half time? We've just tried it and we've just got a defeat now, but doesn't quite come from anything. Manston getting a defeat on the edge though from the rebound. Passing it off to Batsui. Can Batsui pass it to Manston? Yes, he can. Can we get it in the box? And we've just been tackled there by the West Brom defender. And there goes the halftime whistle for this game. And it's finished 1-0 so far. A goal from Van Ginkel. There he is. The man. One shot, one goal. And he's gone and put us 1-0 up in this game. Hopefully to give us all three points in this Premier League fixture. But looking to push on and get another here today. Can we do it? We'll have to wait and see. But here we are in the second half now. West Brom getting on the ball. Back to Chelsea now on the next highlight here. Manson getting on the ball, trying to cut central. Passing it to Solanke, who's striker. Passing it around. Can we work it into the box now? Nothing coming of this left wing attack. Can we get it in the box with Pedro here? Pedro holding on to it for a long time. Working his way around, tripping over some defenders. Getting a shot there from the striker. Getting a shot from Pedro. And it goes out of play there for a corner kick. Nothing coming of that corner though. Manson making his way up the right wing now. 61st minute. A bit of skill there. Not around the defender enough. But we still managed to get somewhere. And then we got tackled. Unlucky for us. West Brom on the attack now. Can we get the ball back? Manson wins the ball back here. Pushing up the right wing into a bit of space that he's made for himself. After getting that good tackle in there. Can we get a chance here? A good little turn from Manson here. Can we work it around? We got a great chance here in the box. And he's jumped over it. And the other player, Van Ginkel, once again, has tried to shot. 
but it didn't go in the corner and it got saved very easily by the goalkeeper then. Here's Manston getting on the ball now, passing it through to the overlapping right back here. And can we get it in the box? Great pass from Manston, putting it in the box now. Unlucky with the header there. Van Ginkle again, he is on form in this game so far. Great attacking runs, great options, and he's just can't quite put in his second goal of the game. There's a good shot there from West Brom. Good save from Couture. 86 minutes played, last couple of minutes of this game. Can we hold on to this 1-0? Here come West Brom with the corner. Can they get a goal from this corner? Put it into the box. Near post for Rondon. And Rondon has gone and made it 1-1. This is just not what we needed. Our three points have been minus down to from 2-1. Two to one because of that. I have to admit that was a pretty good goal from the West Brom players there. Corner into the near post to Rondon who volleys it in first time on the first touch as well into the top of the net and it's gone straight past Couture and gone in for his second goal of the season. Rondon there with the goal and it looks like it's going to be a draw here today. It's the 86th or 7th minute in this game and it looks like we aren't going to be able to bring this back unless we can get an attack straight off this uh, kick off here now here we come though can we get the ball down Manson gets a defeat we got a good chance a bit of space here can we push into the space now can we pass it to the striker we're trying to cut central we've got some options but we're going alone and we've tried to pass too late and it's gone straight to the West Brom players Manson getting the tackle in there once again though we got some options for our last minute goal can we get it in now and it's just been crossed too near to the goalkeeper and he's got the rebounded reflection saved to his hands and that game has ended 1-1, one, one. unlucky for Chelsea. We should have gone and scored a second, but West Brom came back and managed to get an equalising goal because we didn't capitalise on our chances. And that game's finished 1-1, one, one, so that's only a point on the table for us. And our Premier League season so far is not off to the best of starts. Newcastle are actually sitting around top of the table, our previous club last season. But here we are now, just back at the apartment where we are, where we're renting just for now, just until we can save enough money to buy the house which will be in the next episode or two guys so stay tuned and watch out for that one because that's going to be coming up pretty soon we're just having some dinner just getting relaxed a couple days before the next game the next game is going to be the big game against Seville in the Champions League so we're going to get some rest here wake up only a couple days between games and then we're going to head straight off to the stadium to play our next game after having a good rest we're just heading up to bed now and there we go we're gonna have a sleep now and wake up a couple of days later obviously doing something in those other days but here we are waking up on game day of our champions league debut against seville this is going to be a big game for us it's the first game of the champions league group stages for chelsea so let's hope we can push on and get three points that we need to make first or second place to get into the knockout rounds this is our first ever time playing in the champions league and we need to make the most of it there we are that's our table so we've got to play against Chelsea, Dortmund, Seville and Copenhagen so we need to push on and get some results against these teams. Dortmund are the most likely team by the looks of it to go up just on reputation as well as Chelsea hopefully but never rule out the other teams as there is a good chance they can come back with some good results especially if we aren't playing up to standard but here we are now coming into the game our first ever Champions League game our Champions League debut at home for Chelsea at Stamford Bridge against Seville FC who've made the trip over here from Spain on this late night fixture here in the midweek on the Champions League Copenhagen and Dortmund left the play as well after this game but for now we're going to focus on this 4-3-3 here from Chelsea Eden Hazard, Fabregas, Mikel, Oscar and Batshuayi all playing alongside Manson who's up on the right wing just getting ready for this game now. A big game, a nervous game. We are ready for this though. We are ready, it's raining here in London. And we just need to push on and get the result that we need. Push on, get some early goals away. And they've already set off our Champions League campaign. Let's hope we can get some results in. Hope we can push on. Here we go with the kickoff in our Champions League debut. Manston passing it back there and here we go. Mikel on the ball now and it's just going to play around nicely for Chelsea on the first couple of minutes to hold on to the ball. And here we come with an attack now. Manston through ball to his feet on the right wing. Can we work it into the box now? Turning around, passing it back to the centre midfield. He threw balls to the striker who has a shot there from Mikel. And it's gone wide. Not too great of a shot for him. But we got a first shot away in the third minute. And here we come now with the next fixture. Seville on the attack now. Trying to push forward and get a goal through the central areas. Great chance there for Silva of Seville and he's gone and pushed it over the bar with that shot on the edge of the box. Here they come once again on another attack. Can they put the ball in now? Working it around nicely. 
Passing it central on the edge of the box there. Another shot there. Good save from Couture and it's gone out for a corner. Here comes Chelsea on the next attack. Pushing forward. Manston getting on the ball now. Can we get a chance here from this attack? Striker's gone central with great through ball there to Batsui. He's going to have a shot. He's just been saved by the goalkeeper. Another chance though for Manston. Here comes Sam Manson once again with another little toe poke. And it's just been pushed out wide. Good chances there for Chelsea in the 20th minute. Good warning shots against this team. Seville, who we are playing well against. A shot there from Manson. It's gone way over the crossbar and nothing comes of it after that. Flurry of attacks there. 35 minutes played here now. And Seville getting on the ball with Benyetta who threw balls it. Great through ball to the winger now. Can he work it into the box here to make it 1-0 for Seville? He's cutting around the edge, holding onto it nicely. A good shot there from the defender. Rebound and it's gone straight to Kotoa's hands and he saved it nicely. 43rd minute approaching half time now. Getting on the ball is Manston here. Can he do anything with it now? Pushing it forward to, uh, to Oscar who lays it off unluckily for Manston and doesn't quite get it through. And here we are coming any minute now into half time. It's a Ville on the midfield attack and there it goes. Half time here. Even chances for both games. A very, very good chance from Chelsea and Manston and I think Hazard it was. Unlucky we didn't score there. And it's still nil-nil here coming into half time. And we're going to start the second half full of energy. And here comes Seville with the kickoff. And here we go now. Can we get a result here today? Can we work it around? Can we work it around enough to get the result? A great through ball there to Manston's feet. Can Manson get on the end of it? He can. He's taking a good touch around the defender. Can we work it into the box now? Manson, great through ball to Abregas. And he's just gone and put it first time shot over the bar. Just narrowly over the bar from Manston but here comes Chelsea on another attack a good three ball to Manston who's going to try and lay it off to Batsui who's got a great time to shoot Manson asks for it back unluckily though accidentally asked for it back well not accidentally but I shouldn't have done it and we didn't quite capitalise on that chance because the ball came too far backwards here comes Seville now 70th minute on the attack can they work it into the box here Seville pushing through good three ball there to Ben Yedda, who's had a shot I think that was Ben Yedda with a goal for Seville and it's gone in to make it 1-0 here in the 71st minute against Chelsea. They've gone 1-0 up in this first group stage of the Champions League and that's a disappointing goal to concede there. Good through ball there from the Seville player. Good first second touch finish and it's gone in to make it 1-0 here. Sorry not Ben yet. Andre Silva second goal in the Champions League. He must have played in the qualifying rounds to get another goal as well and that's 1-0 in the 71st minute to Seville but Chelsea can hopefully push on with 20 minutes remaining and get a goal Manston on the ball now can we work it in the box here we've got a good chance to cross it in now can we get it in cross it in to the striker who's just not quite got a head on it and we can't quite make anything of that Zaza comes on now for Chelsea up front and here comes Seville with another shot, a good save there from Courtois to keep them out and Seville are on the rampage at the moment, 87 minutes played, here comes Seville once again with a great chance laying it off the edge of the box, what a shot there, good save from Courtois and he's got it in his hands, can we do anything with this now, 88 minutes, 90th minute, not much time left at all to try and snatch a goal back, but let's try anyway, but Seville, we can't get the ball off them and it looks like this game's going to end 1-0 and there it goes. It's finished 1-0 here at Stamford Bridge in our Champions League debut. That is not the dream debut that we were looking for. It was anything but that. We lost 1-0 to Seville. They've gone three points up in the table. We're sat at the bottom on zero. And we're just leaving the stadium after the game. Just disappointed, really. It wasn't the result we were looking for. We needed those points. We want to get somewhere in the Champions League for our first season. But it's going to be hard. This shows how tough the Champions League really is. And we're just going to head off home now. Very disappointed and just looking to push on and forget about it and get into the next couple of games, which will be in the next episode, guys. So please like, share and subscribe for more videos because they are definitely on their way, hopefully daily uploads. So please and comment anything you want to see happen. I'll see you in the next episode. Peace.